Hey guys, it's Felicia with Happily Ever After Living. Today is Sunday. Today is Sunday, February 6th, and I am about to do my meal prep. It is 2.50 in the afternoon. I've been, I've been doing like a lot of work for business. I gotta get going. Um, my plan is to go to bed by 9.30 tonight. So I'm gonna show you guys most of my meal prep, but if I forget certain things, it's not intentional. I'm just rushing today, honestly. So I'm gonna flip the camera around and show you here in my refrigerator what I have planned for me to eat for this week. All right, so this week I'm keeping it simple. I'm having grits, girls raising the South, ha ha ha. Two boiled eggs, fruit for breakfast, and then for lunch, um, chicken thighs with stuffed peppers, fruit and cheese. And then for dinners, chili with turkey and beans and salad. So this week I would just be repeating all of my meals, eating the same thing over and over again. So first thing I'm about to do is just boil all of these eggs. All right, so we're gonna let those cook. The next thing I'm gonna do is heat up this pan. Why did I turn that one on? Goofy. Heat up this pan so that I can ground the ground turkey for the stuffed peppers as well as for the um, chili. So I decided I would only do um, like the chili, the turkey for the chili first. So 16 ounces, I'll use this for, but use a different seasoning. So 16 ounces of turkey and this is the seasoning that I'm using. For the chicken, I'm kind of in the mood just for this seasoning and a little bit of black pepper, keeping it simple. Oh, also, I fully realized I have on the same shirt that I had on yesterday. But why waste clothes? It's still clean. So I'm just going to toss this a little bit. This is what it looks like and I'm about to put it inside. All right, so for the chili, I am going to use kidney beans. I wish I had, like there's no recipe. You guys know I just cook like whatever I have, however I want, so dark kidney beans, black beans, diced tomatoes, Diced tomatoes, diced tomatoes, diced tomatoes, black beans, and more kidney beans. So I'll put a total like of how many beans and how many things of tomatoes at the bottom, okay? So I have wiped these off. I'm going to empty these into the Instant Pot, um, and then I'll add the meat. So I've added everything, and usually I would drain, I would drain the beans before adding them but since I'm making a chili I just left it because it's probably going to mostly cook down and then I'm adding one more pack of this and now I need to go and add the ground turkey okay so I'm pretty sure that I'm over the fill line <laughs> So what I'm going to do is just turn it on saute and let it start cooking down a little bit. And then I'll put the um, pressure cooker function on. So let's just hit saute and then it'll start cooking down a little bit and it's absorb some of the water. And if I have to, I'll just take a little bit off the top and it'll be fine. All right, so it still has all that liquid in there. I'm just gonna try anyways. So going to bean chili. 115 and I don't think it needs to cook that long so let's bring the let's bring it down because everything's already pre-cooked like these aren't dry beans uh, 40 sounds good all right So one, two, three, four, two, and 
eggs, all peeled, two for each day. Don't even, it'll be okay. <laughs> all right guys, so for my stuffed peppers, what I will be using, cauliflower rice. Um, I have two bags of those. And then this, you guys may have seen me use the uh, Rayo's sauce before. You know what, I was at the grocery store on Friday this is $8.99 now. <laughs> I think I paid $5.79 last week from Walmart, but at Winn Dixie it was $8.99. So crazy. And then I have some peppers here that I'll be using. I have one, two, I have six peppers and then also some cheese. So let's get going. So first thing I'm gonna do is throw these in the microwave because you know I don't have time to cook them all. So here is the chicken, all done. And then I emptied all of the cauliflower rice in with the ground turkey. And then I'll add a little bit of um, spaghetti sauce. Here. All right guys, so I just took all of the mixture out of here and I stuffed the peppers. And again, we have the cauliflower, ground turkey, and that um, spaghetti sauce. And this one wasn't gonna fit, so we're just gonna leave it out. Pretend like it never happened. And I would have like showed you guys the process when I was stuffing, but my mom is here. She was Hi. talking to me. So blame her. Blame her. Learning new things. Learning new things. <laughs> Learning. Teaching me new things. Alright, so I baked them for 30 minutes at 375. This is how they look. Let me grab a cheese. All right, so now I need to prepare my dinner salads. So I'm doing five for this week. And you guys have seen me prep salads a million times. So I'll wash everything and then chop, prep, and we'll just make some magic. So before, here are my salads for the week. I'll just cut that as I go because I don't want it to get yucky. So here is the chili. I guess I should have also stated that this is not just for me. Like this is for the entire family. So we're actually having this tonight as well. So as I serve their, um, as I serve their bowls of chili tonight I'll be able to take some of the liquid off so I'm not too concerned all right you guys here are my meals for the week my salads with chili in the evenings the stuffed peppers got some chicken thighs and then for breakfast um, eggs grits fruit fruit for lunch and yeah all set so i'm really excited and prepared for this week let's get it so today's meal prep took me a little bit shy of two hours but i'm just now finishing like we've had dinner and everything so i'm a little tired but i'm happy that i got it done and i'm really looking forward to this week I'm looking forward to not having to think during the week about my meals because everything is already prepared and ready to go. Don't forget that if you like videos like this, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. I gotta put my house back together. Bye.